developing a relationship with that part of you like a deep one where no matter what fucking challenge comes up in your life how sick you get how much someone cheats on you and fucking breaks up the family and you lose your job and you're fucking being assaulted i mean there's plenty of ways <laughs> shit shows up in our life you have to actually believe that <laughs> you're capable of fucking helping yourself and fucking creating a sick life for yourself like you got to believe in yourself you don't that's not like given to us out of the womb you got to fucking spend time <laughs> thinking about that and be like you know what i've got to really work on this because at the moment i don't believe in myself so <laughs> just know that that shit doesn't come easy but work on believing in yourself but then having the faith that no matter what challenge is thrown in you that it's been put there for you to grow you slowly develop into a more mature person then you come into another challenge and it creates another person and then over time you build a character that's got no resemblance to the character that you were six months ago six years ago Evolution means like there's constant progression. That's the goal in life. But the only way you, you get to that understanding is just seeing a challenge as a lesson for you to, to learn and grow from. Once you've got that, you've got inner peace. Because inner peace means no matter what happens on the external, that you remain calm, collected, grateful and appreciative of being alive because you love life in any circumstance not just because you've got green lights in your life no not no it's like under any circumstance when you got depression when you have suicidal thoughts right it's seeing all that as lessons as ways to be humble and to learn and to be surrendered the ego and stop thinking that you know it all and to surrender and be like okay i need help only when you're comfortable doing that practicing that embodying not having an ego that means when you interact with the world you're very uh quiet <laughs> and introspective and very aware and you're careful not to talk too much because you're like hang on <laughs> whatever comes out of my mouth has been shit so let me just see what a mature way of talking is like it's part of inner peace it's like you've got to change from the habitual reactions out of your subconscious into reactions that you consciously have to program again put that one rewind listen to it again once you've reprogrammed the way you talk to yourself and the way you see challenges that's how you get inner peace that's exactly that's all it is it's nothing fancy but you know surrendering the ego and accepting that there's something wrong with you is hard for most if not all people like it's not every day that you see someone dramatically improve their personality overnight it's like it's hard work so i'll leave that with you in a piece make it the goal of your life and your life becomes pretty fucking cool